All right, so we're heading down. Beauty is way out there in the pasture. She was eating some grass, which they have been on hay all winter. They're sick of hay. They want some grass. They want something fresh. So that's what she was doing out there. So, yeah. I hear Gracie playing with her hay net. She like all like does stuff with it. So, yeah. So, hello, beauties. Good morning. The fields have been so muddy and beauty. A thorn. Ow! Thorn in your. There's a thorn in your floor left. That probably hurts. Where'd you get that from? As you can see, it's all mucky and... Hi, Grace. She's run away. She don't like us. Okay. Beauty, I want to get the briar out of you. Honey. Honey. Look at that. Oh, Beauty. Oh, my word. So, yeah. Let's... Like so, hay nuts. So first, I just am going to. This is my little step, like mounting block thing, but I flip it over and use it to make hay nuts. So that's what I do. I'm gonna try to find. Weird. Okay, so um, I use a. I have a knife down here. Just like cut the rails all up, so I can cut like these. So we have um. It's like with this bale string, so I have to cut it before I can like open it. So that's how you open it. It's not like hay where it's in a bag, it's just like open and it's a little more dry than hay -like. But so I give them like two of these, and yeah, I'll see you when we do that. So yeah. are sassy all right so um now i need to t get down the um hay nuts because uh yeah that's what i need to do so i'm just gonna chuck the stool over the fence uh, <laughs> like that um and i don't use the gate um oh gracie Oh my word, beauty, I'm so sorry for you. Okay, um, so if you could have heard that, Gracie just took a bite at beauty. It's not very good, so I'm gonna give you another one or another flake or something. Okay, so I I am gonna try to do this with the camera. Okay, okay. As you can see, I'm just fitting through the fence and not even going through the gate. Because gates take pretty long to open and close and open and close and open and close. So, there we go. So, we must be nice to each other um, while well, I do the hang up. So, as you can see, I didn't need to take them down. They are hanging up in our um, field shelter. So, yeah, I will. Uh, do that real quick, so, yeah.
All right, so got the hay net down. These are actually two hay nets. Um, so I got one more to go. So yeah, hopefully it'll be good. Okay, so next we have that one. I have two because my horses won't share hay nets. They're greedy eaters. So let's just untie this real quick. It's hard one-handed, but we'll get it done. Sorry for that struggle, it's just <laughs> I'm one-handed holding the camera in one hand and doing that in the other. So we got the two hands. These are from, I don't know where they're from, but I just got them off on State Line Tack. So that's where they're from. Alright, so now I just fit through these little whole thing. They can't fit through it, but I can, so. So we chuck the hay on the ground and I need to go get my stool again because I have this little trick where I um, have the stool, I flip it over and then I use it as like a little uh, um, I use it as a little like, it, it's a bit more easy to make the hay nets and that doesn't fit through so I just chuck it over the fence. So, yeah, we make the hay So basically, I just do it like that, and then put the hay net um, on either side of it, and it's quite easy to make the hay net. So, whew, well, let's do this. All right, so I've got the second hangout all done. Um, um, so having the second hangout done, now we can hang them up. Pepper has decided to join us. Um, so I hope you enjoyed that time lapse. Uh, it was a lot harder in real life than it was doing the time lapse. So. Yeah, so it's about um, 9.30 right now, um, because just trying to get the GoPro set up and the camera, it takes a long time. Normally, I'd be done at 8.30, but it's taken me a lot longer, um, so, yeah, so let's hang those paintings up. So again, we need to chuck uh, this thing back into the... Uh, because I need it, um, badly. So, come in, um, just grab this. We're taking it in. I get so dirty, like, my pants always get so dirty. Um, so, yeah, this goes there. So I can hang it up, so. I will do that in a second for you guys.
All right, so I got that hay net up, um, and I just used a quick release knot to tie it up there. Um, tying them farther up is a lot safer um, than having them lower because um, lower they can get their legs stuck, they, they can get tangled in it. But when it's high like that, it's like they can still probably somehow get tangled in it if they got it down. But but I think it's less likely for them to get stuck in it. So um, so I just need to hang up the other one. And yeah. Okay, I've just decided to come back. And it's like 11.38 lunchtime-ish. And Gracie has decided to put her leg in the crate. Why? You're a horse. You're not a goat. Don't go to that. Like, they, like, stand in their feeders. Gracie. Jeez, honey. That's, that's really stupid, honestly. You're, you're not light enough to be in there. Whatever. You're fine. Okay, so I decided to organize the tack room and uh, my little storage tack room thing. Also, the they're hang all hung up. Okay, so as you can see, you can tell there is we have a mess, and I've started to organize, and that's why I made it messy, a little messy. So we have fly stuff everywhere. It's really gross, really messy. Um, and I brought some storage bins up to my house. Um, these ones, so I can put some, rug I can't put a rug in this, but I can put some fly masks in that, and then have this one be like some rugs um, in it. And then also, I'm gonna probably end up washing my brushes. They're really dirty. I need a good brush, like brushing your brush washing them i don't know in water so yeah that's what we're doing um so yeah i'll set the camera up to do a tech room organization okay so i think all my bridles and halters are fairly organized um uh i'm pretty sure like as organized as they get the shelf it's kind of organized we are cleaning the brushes um then this tub you just a washed old water and muck tub, so I don't like the thin thing, and I don't really use it very much anymore. So that's that, and then I have this gross sweatshirt that's probably been in here for like ages, probably like years. <laughs> it's gross, um, disgusting. I probably got hot in the summer and then took it off, and then just decided to leave it out. So I'm just gonna check it here. Gracie's leg like, is literally in the crate, as I was telling you, like, she just, like, put her leg in the crate to stand in it, so it's such a nice day, um, it's sunny and warm out, so, mm -hmm. so, my saddle, they do need to be a bit more organized, um, so, less in, is right here, so this, Beauties in my saddle. Um, Gracie's saddle, I meant, um, I just went in on. Then we have my linear saddle pad. So all the saddle pads can technically go under here in this bar. I have only three English saddle pads. Um, I have this. Uh, blue one. I don't know what brand this is. Uh, it's Tough Rider. And then this is Lemire Pro Sport in Oak, and it's close contact, I'm pretty sure. Um, and then we have this CM, I don't know what this stands for, dressage pad, and then I have the little ear bonnet for that too, as well. So we're gonna I have to organize that a lot so let's get to it <laughs>
So let's get folding that. Okay, so we got um, two fly masks in here and then one fly rug, just in this tiny little bin. Okay, so that's my hand, that's a bin. It's pretty small, so um, that's that. We can probably fold up that rug and then put it into one of these cases. I always keep these cases some reason um so yeah let's do that okay so i got that folded up nicely below the saddle stand but now i'm worried that i won't be able to put my pads on like i used to just have them right here hanging down but i don't know if i'm gonna be able to do that so we'll see okay look how good that looks looks a lot more prettier so, now, I just need to decide if I'm going to put my saddle pads there or not. I'm just going to see if they're a little funky, so, yeah. Okay, it looks pretty good. Kind of, like, interesting. But if I fix, so there's some girths. All my English girths are on here. I agree. And then my little half pad under there. Um, so in this small gear, I was planning on having it here, but that looks really cramped and bad. So I'll put it on the shelf. So yeah. Oh. 
and feed. basically my whole day routine. It's about seven right now. The horses are eating, very happy. Um, so, yeah, I'm just gonna quickly scooch Gracie's pull a little bit more away. As you can see, she's a bit close to the fence. Um, so, yeah, it's very interesting. So, yeah, let's go. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to subscribe um, to my channel. That really makes me happy. Uh, so, yeah.